In this demo I will show you how MDT 2010 integrates with the user state migration tool version 4. Remember from our last demo I was running the scan state and load state command manually. We're not really supposed to do that. We are supposed to use MDT to drive that process for us. And built into the sequences there are actually ready-made capture state actions in here This will run scan state. And later on in the restore phase, there will be a restore user state action running load state. So if I go to a client, on this client I simply added a shortcut to the light touch script. So I can either run it from the server or just double click this shortcut. Select my sequence, specify whether I want a complete backup or not, in addition to the USMD backup. Select any apps, I maybe want Office, and I click off the setup. And now the sequence will actually do all things automatically for me. It will run scan state, storing the backup locally. Then it will reboot into WinP, apply the operating system, install the Office application, and then later on restore the backup for me. Going back to the server, what I also can do is create a sequence that will do a backup job only, and that is called a replay sequence. So I will right click my sequences and select new, give it a name and call it replace. And instead of using the normal client sequence template, I will select standard replay sequence. And now what I get is a sequence that will only do a backup job for me without deploying the OS. So when I'm replacing machines in my company, I can run this one on the old machines and then I basically can go to the new machines and treat them as bare metal deployments and during that visit I can prompt them or being prompted for what backup to restore on that machine.